Welcome. In this lesson, we will learn about compute verb. As of now, we have learned about add, subtract, divide, and multiply. Let's assume that we have an expression which consists of addition, subtraction, division, and multiplication. To execute that expression, we can use compute keyword of COBOL program. In compute statement, we start with compute COBOL keyword followed by a variable followed by equal to sign and then the expression which we need to execute. In compute, the arithmetic expression to the right of the equal sign is evaluated and the result is assigned to the data item on the left of the equal sign. The arithmetic expression is normally evaluated from left to right, but bracketing and precedence rule can change the order of evaluation. Here is a table about the order of the precedence of the symbols. First precedence is for power, which is denoted by symbol of double star. Second precedence is for multiply and divide. Multiply is denoted by single star, whereas divide is denoted by a slash. Third precedence is for add and subtract. Add is denoted by plus sign and subtract by minus sign. Now let's understand with the help of some letter values. We have defined a variable name as result with pick of 9 of 4 and initialize it with a value of 3333. Now we are executing the arithmetic expression and we are going to give the result to the result variable. To do so, we first write the compute verb followed by the variable name which in this case is result followed by equal to sign and then the arithmetic expression. Here the arithmetic expression is 90 minus 7 into 3 plus 50 divided by 2. In this arithmetic expression, first precedence will go to 7 into 3 that will result into 21 and second precedence will go to the divide which is 50 by 2 that will give 25. As the evaluation is done from left to right, subtraction will happen first in this case and addition will happen later. So 90 minus 21 will give 69 and after that 69 will, will be added to 25 that will result into 94. Before this expression the value in the result variable was 3333 and after the execution of this compute statement the result variable will hold only 94. Now let's understand with one more example. In this example we are using rounded phrase. The value of the division of dollar and exchange rate will go to euro variable. Euro variable is defined with pick 9 of 5 V99 and the initial value assigned to is 3425.15. Similarly, dollar is defined with pick of 9 5 times V99 and the initial value assigned is 1234.75. And the exchange rate is defined with pick of 9 V94 times and the value assigned to it is 1.3017. Here is the table which shows before and after value of all these three variables. After the compute statement, the euro will hold 948.57. The actual result is having a lot of digits after the decimal. Since we have defined euro with pick of 5 V99 that is two places after decimal, the value got rounded off and we got 57 after the decimal. The value of dollar and exchange rate will not change and remain as it is. With this, we have reached the end of this lesson. I hope it has given you a good idea about compute work. Keep practicing. See you.